So, Delphine keeps up the fight after all these years. I thought she'd have realized it's hopeless by now. I tried to tell her years ago. Haven't you figured it out yet? Aldwin has returned, the dragon from the dawn of time. No one can escape his hunger. Ah, I tried to tell them, they wouldn't listen. Oh yes, only a dragon board. It seems that the gods have grown tired of us. They've left us to our fate as the... What? Then... Then there is hope. We must go. Quickly now. Take me to Delphine. We have much to discuss. So, Delphine... I thought she'd have realized it's hopeless by now. But give me just a moment. I must gather a few things. We should... My annotated annual. An amulet of Mara. You're looking for marriage, must then? Leave secrets for the thousand. One more I must bring. Well, I guess that's good enough. Let's be off. Say something? We should keep moving. There's two
Even if you're one of us, you better not make trouble. How can a humble servant of Talos help you today? That old woman who runs the orphanage has been murdered. Say, didn't I see you coming out? If you're wondering why they call me different, watch me out from the town yard. Mercer, this is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. This better not be another waste of the guild's resources to bring you all food. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. We do what we say, when we say. Do I make myself clear? Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. I suggest you listen. Wait a moment. You're not talking about Golden Glow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work. If so, let him prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Brynjolf will provide you with the details. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Mm hmm? Oh, yes. Since Brynjolf assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. Welcome to the Thieves' Guild. Welcome to the family, lad. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin. So don't disappoint me. Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. You should talk with Delvin Mallory and Vex. Oh, and talk to Tonelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Hey, Golden Glow, we need you to teach him a lesson, but the catch is that you can't. That important client, Mercer mentioned. Aye, the last thing we want. Maven preferred. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. You watch yourself on that island. What's the.
Thank you so much it for taking so care much of us. It means so much to us to have the claw back where it belongs. Riverwood Trader is Thank back you. to the way it used Until to be. Do you need something? Delphi. <laughs> it's good to see you. It's been a long time. It's good to see two, Esbern. Two, old friend. Well, then. You made it safe and sound. Good. Come on. Let's see what Esbern has to say. Now then, I assume you know about... Oh, yes. Dragon Ball, indeed, yes. Oh, this changes everything, of course. But no time to lose, so we must... Let me show you. I... Oh, I have it here somewhere. Esbern, what? Give me... Be just a moment, though. Ah, here it is. Come, let me show you. You see, right here, Sky Haven Temple, constructed around one of the main Akadri military camps in the Reach during their conquest of Skyrim. Do you know what he's talking about? Shh. This is where they built Aldwin's Hall to set down and stone all their accumulated dragons. Hedge against the forgetfulness of centuries. A wise and foresighted policy in the event. Huh? Despite the far reaching fame of Aldwin's Wall at the time, one of the wonders of the ancient world, its location was lost. Esbern, what are you getting at? You mean, you don't mean to say you haven't heard of Aldwin's Wall? Either of you? Let's pretend we haven't. What's Alduin's Wall, and what does it have to do with stopping the dragons? Alduin's Wall was where the ancient blades recorded all they knew of Alduin and his return. Part history, part prophecy. His location has been lost for centuries, but I have found it again. Not lost, you see, just forgotten. The blades' archives held so many secrets. I was only able to save a few scraps. So you think that Alduin's wall will tell us how to defeat Alduin? Well, yeah. Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. You don't know anything about this house? Excuse me, but do you know anything about... Seems no... I'm with the Vigil of Stendar. I was actually just about to head on inside. Follow me and... Thank you for your time. Well, what am I supposed to do? Never leave the house? You want that ending? Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Don't mind the yelling. 
My parents are always going at each other. I'm what you'd call a soldier of fortune. Make me an offer, and I just might fight at your side. Well, what news? Thank you. And I'll never forget you. Now you just tell me if you need what something. What was that you said? Thank Venom's you again. I should well, yes. Pepper. Why wouldn't I be? Nothing, you Are you oaf. interested in me? It's settled then. Brief as life can be in Skyrim, at least we'll have each other. You come right to me if you find an unwell. Thank you again for result. My... something? Come to laugh at the grave tender? I can see that disapproving look in your eye. Hmm? to maintain civility while you're here. Lady Mara bids you wait. We are devoted. Her blessings are many. To receive. Ex are you prepared then? The do Mara, the village. This I will entreat Mara on your behalf. People of Riften, heed blessings of Mara. You wish to be. Your wedding will be. Don't be late. You don't want to miss your own wedding. This is one of the signs. The sign. How may I help you, my son? Blessings of Mara upon you. May you return to her benevolence and safety.
Ah, here's the proud groom now. Let's begin the ceremony. It was Mara that first gave birth to all of creation and pledged to watch over us as her children. It is from her love of us that we first learned to love one another. It is from this love that we learned that a life lived alone is no life at all. We gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship. May they journey forth together in this life and in the next, in prosperity and poverty and in joy and hardship. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? I do, now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? Under the authority of Mara, the divine of love, I declare this couple to be wed. I present the two of you with these matching rings, blessed by Mara's divine grace. Congratulations on your grace. wedding. We need to decide I'm so where we're living, won't we? In your you new can life always together. stay with me. Our new home. I'll see you there. Congratulations on your wedding. Let's hear it! Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving.
I've read the dragon like Spoken is most interesting. Let's keep moving. <laughs> 